didn't think he was. He got the results to get tenth, but good for him. I mean, every t I, I, this is I don't know shit, right? But like every time I've come, he's gotten top eight. So I don't know beyond that. Yeah, just an your own anecdotal evidence. Yeah, oh, my, okay, yeah, my anecdotal evidence. <laughs> Pink right. Rob, let's see it, Matt. Let's Matt go. Antonio. Yes. This should be a good set. Gonna start off with, with Krom this this one. Yeah. Uh, you know, oddly enough, with how bad Krom's recovery is, I actually can't see a whole lot against Rob can go for it because the super armor should be able to go through all of Rob's projectiles. Yeah. If he has to go gyro. low, he is fucked. Right. Straight up. Uh, yeah. But Rob, I mean, I think Roy's in the same. Time. Yeah. Rob is definitely able to chase uh, Krom down, but if if he can get that up B out early, it's definitely something that. Matt's going to have to look out for it. Yeah. You have to give a lot of respect to it, because you don't want to go down with Kron. No, no, you do not want to go down. Uh, so, yeah, we're starting this game off. Uh, Matt, probably developing quite a strong lead here. Yeah, he's really good. Tonyo had that gyro, but didn't really do anything with it. Yeah. Immediately got grabbed for it. Yeah. That's something uh, I love to see as the set goes on. Like, what is he doing with that? Oh, that was some really good shield pressure, though, with throwing up the gyro and up air. Wasn't able to fast fall in into a second up air there, so Matt was able to just drop shield. Yeah, no. I Matt's showing why he's the one that he's the why he's the wielder of the gyro instead. <laughs> oh wait, hold on, bro. Oh. Oh. Getting caught with that dash attack. Definitely wanted to drop down back here. Gonna yeah. get caught with an up smash for it. It happens. Bro. It happens. Bro. Okay. And not all of us can play on Smashbox. Bro, he. Hey, yo, <laughs> Why we bring it personal? <laughs> It's a down throw forward air though. This this is definitely from from what Fair. it was looking like. This is a lot closer mm -hmm. of a game. Mm -hmm. And look at this movement coming from coming from Tonyo getting the down air. Great tech on Matt's part, however. Yeah, bro. Croys love going for that dare, bro. They they pray that shit spikes every day. Yeah, it, 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 but I mean it did. I was like you can't blame a man if it if it actually that's hits. Right, that's right. Has a gyro back in hand now. I know Krom has some some silly combos out of it. Not gonna be able to land that time. Yeah. Matt knowing to shield it. Yep. Oh, because the chair yeah. though. Chair, baby. It goes, goes, off that goes for the late wave land to sh to, sh to sh move there, but not able to get it. So just opts to stay on the floor. <laughs> Don't commentate. <laughs> Most stock movement, bro. <laughs> Great forward throw on mass part. Not gonna have enough juice to laser there. Yeah. Oh, that was kind of terrifying. Oh wait, we it have a combo of all time here. Getting 42. Can he get more? Rob being above Krom, not where he wants to be. It reverses it with that nair. Okay. Great air dodge backstage. Got to get called out for that jump there. Matt recognizing exactly what uh, Tony wanted to go for there. That was a good call out. That was a good call out. Oh. Oh, this could be very terrifying. Putting him in the corner. Dropping down with that, that short hop uh, nair as Rob is very scary. Great spot mm -hmm. dodge. Going to be able to avoid 30% there from that laser. Oh, going to have to recover here. Going for the nair. Like I said, Rob kind of has to respect that recovery, unlike yeah. uh, most other top tiers, mm -hmm. who always have something that can, that can go against it. Like, Rob doesn't have a rapid jab and a move with armor. Yeah. He just has amazing neutral. Going to be able to get 72% <laughs> over Tonio. Absolutely insane. Going for that down tilt gyro set up, but Tonio knows better. Yeah. It's Still going to get caught tough. with 93%. I mean, granted, if he can open this up, if he can find the stock and open it up, the, the core advantage, they do go crazy. Yeah, exactly. I, I feel I feel exactly the same way. We Krom had some absolutely ridiculous true combos that he can go for to take stocks early. Not having a side B like Roy does to end those stocks, and gonna get hit with a gyro, using this up B very well. Yeah. Like, oh, with a gyro missing the tech. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. Being patient. Yeah, like I said, Rob, unlike other top just can't really do a whole lot against uh, Krom's recovery. And like when everyone when everyone says just just throw him off stage. Just throw him off stage. Yeah. Rob's like, well, I can't. I, well, I mean, I can, but. What but it doesn't happen? help. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and in this, I mean, the, and we're talking about pressing neutral with Rob, bro. Look at that. Ooh, drop neutral. down back oh, here. Bro. Another good thing with Krom, that with Roy, that definitely would have been a sour spot. Yep. Ooh. Able oh. to take the stock though, right there. Oh, the see, like I said, the armor gonna be able to go right through that down air and saving his uh, jump. Yep. Not gonna do it this second time. But yep. like I said, like I was saying before, it's it's really hard for Rob to, to get Krom like that. Yeah. Normally. How how often does Matt said he looks like Jack Harlow? I assume like every day of his life. <laughs> I mean, look at look at him. Every every dude with that curly brown hair, bro. They're all every single one of them. Low key built like Tilting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's what, that's that was my first thought. I, I can see it. I can see it. It's, I'm sorry for everyone with that haircut. You're all gonna get confused with each other. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Will Farrell bringing out the Roy instead. Understandable. Yeah. Going going up a bit. Uh, up up in the tier list here. Mm -hmm. See if it makes a difference. I mean, he'll be able to find those stocks a little earlier, especially on Town and City, right? Yeah, this is easily Roy's best stage. I wonder why uh, Matt left it open. Uh, I can't imagine uh, what else he would have been aside from Town and City. But Battlefield, maybe most likely. I don't know. Do you all do uh, characters before stages? Yes. Okay. Then I winner def winner chooses their character first. Mm -hmm. So 
Um, I'm, yeah, I am very surprised. It's a great side view right there. Uh, gonna get that percent. Racking it up. Yeah, even though this is Roy's best stage, yeah. a lot worse off stage than Krom in this matchup for I, sure. I want to say that was a bit of a Krom habit coming out there because Krom there just goes up and down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He wanted that, that early Krom up B and to snap ledge. Yeah, unfortunate, but I mean, 113, Roy kills at any percent. So. Yeah, well, I mean, we, we kind of saw, like, uh, even though, yeah, he is getting hit when he's off stage and dying for it, Tonio's living until, like, 130, yeah. which is a pretty normal percent, or even, like, a late percent to diet anyway. So it's yeah. not exact, It's not like he's getting ginned or, like, losing his stocks incredibly That's early. Matt just outplaying him. Don't die here? Okay. Good DI. Good yeah, DI. not getting crossed up there, mm -hmm. which is honestly, oh, my God. Oh, yeah. my God. Just, just oh. throwing the rockets at their sliding yeah. Etzel gonna be able yeah. to take that first stuff. stock though. And Matt changing the song, that shit was bugging my mood. That was actually I couldn't I can't hear any any music. Oh great oh. up to or great up air right there. The DI go crazy. I don't know how he's playing he's absolutely succeeding at these Mario Party minigames. <laughs> but you're not gonna be able to match out of that, gonna get up smashed for it. <laughs> Mario Party minigames, bro. Yeah, doobie. Which 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 way is are you do you have to DI this up air? Which way? Ba -dum, ba -da 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 -da. I mean, Rob's laying it too after he buries you. Are you going to mash it? Yeah. <laughs> are, are you going to mash it? Are you going to DI it properly? <laughs> Getting it on a platform extension, yeah. though, nearly ended, ended Matt's stock there. It's on a solid Roy gameplay. Kill Getting that sweet spot on that side B, not going to be able to take the stock just yet. Roy is a very heavy, heavy character. Okay. Finds that fair out of the corner, pushing him back. Try, he's really trying to find this stock. Oh, I went for that down air. Absolutely yeah. wanted his stock gone. Does not want to play against Roy anymore. I don't blame him either. Yeah. Bro, I love the thought process on throwing that. Ooh, parry into the back air. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Bringing this back. Mm -hmm. Only 33% on his stock. Going to be able to get a grab out of it, though. Can Matt extend this? Okay. Okay, he's able to land. That's a big deal. Take him back center. They're out of shield. This is deadly from Roy, but reverses it on accident. That was definitely not what he wanted. But he's keeping him in the corner, man. This. Th yeah, also very deadly from Roy. Great yes. DI in for Matt, but able to extend that combo. And aside, he's going to be able to take that first game. And the nigga stands up. <laughs> Tonio standing up, knowing that it was going to kill there. That's right. <laughs> He's, he stood up while he was pressing B, knowing yeah, that it that's was... That's right. Match me fell out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was about to say, like, if, if he fell out, bro, was going to have to... Oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Put that headset back on. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, but that was a good start. I mean, uh, Tonio doing a really job. I really did his recoveries that game. That right. was absolutely incredible. That's exactly what we were saying before. You don't take Roy to Hollow or to Town and City. Yep. You can help it. Gonna go to Hollow Bastion this time. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Uh, I, I, yeah. I don't. I agree with this pick um, for like if Tonyo were to pick it, but from that, I don't really understand. Is Hollow Bastion being a very small stage yeah. against a very big sword? I think the concept is is how much laser and gyro are gonna control of the stage because of that. Uh, because of the fact that there is only two layers to it, right? It Maybe. Is. Just uh, from what I know, it's generally better to have those longer stages for for the gyro and, and projectile control. Because mm -hmm. when you when it's smaller, there's um, yeah less space to close. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And with Roy's dash speed being so incredible, he's able to get in on him just like this. Already pushing Matt to the corner, even with the with the forty percent lead that that Matt has, it's definitely not a comfortable one. You know, finding these up airs, keeping him in the juggle situation. He gets down. Ooh. He just needs one in, but it misses it right there. That could have been his chance. Gonna get up tilt up here for it, and doesn't doesn't win the mini game that time. Gonna take us, gonna lose that stock. Also tries to wave dash. They're not gonna be able to succeed. <laughs> bro, stop calling us. <laughs> we just air dodging down now. Yes. Uh, you know what? It still works. It's a drop down. Oh, full hop up air from Roy Def. <laughs> yeah. That, that was not the wave. He's trying to close out this stock. You saw it going for the near one there to SMH. He's really struggling. Wanting, he has to close the stock out and to keep a chance in this game. That dash grab somehow missing on Tonyo's shield there. Tonyo now having the ledge trap situation. One of Roy's best positions, but able to get completely through. He gets a grab out of it. Great match. By the way. Incredible match and a great air dodge going right through that up tilt when he needed it most. That nair hitting below ledge, pretty deadly. That down air would have been even more. The call up, not able quite to get the timing, and like that, Tonyo's able to take stage control back. Looks like Matt's running away with it, not gonna be able to get the combo out of him, but gets the uh, S smash, gonna be able to take the first stock of this game. Yeah, okay, that was, oh, hold on, hold on. It, it is looking like Matt's kind of running away with it here. One grab, one down tilt, gonna be able to yeah. take it with that down smash right there at ledge. Great down smash, covered so many options there. There was pretty much nothing that Tonyo could do except for roll in. Yeah. And I think I think Matt would have reacted. Mm -hmm. Matt reacts to those. That's my goat. Yeah, <laughs> that's the Rob goat. Ooh. Back throw. Oh, don't get spiked. Yeah, this don't is... get gecked. Oh, hold on. Can he get off this ledge, man? Oh, okay. 
Down throw, up air, forward air. Okay. Can he find it? Yeah, can he find it anymore? It's just literally what you were saying. Gets the trip with down tilt. 60% on his stock. This is how we saw it before. Gets the chair. Mm -hmm. Puts it back on ledge, bro. We want to see a ledge trap. You don't want to be winning against Tonio. You have to beat him with the two stocks. <laughs> he's going he's gonna to make you pay for it. Can Matt close it out right here? This is looking pretty scary. Yeah, no. Ooh, that, oh, that oh, gets the setup. Yep. And that down smash is going to be able to take it. Great control for Matt there going yeah. to Hollow Bastion. Yeah. Maybe just one of his best stages in general. Like, a lot yeah. of people don't know how to play on it. No, he hit. Also, he just got a lot of grabs near the end there. Yeah. He definitely was spotted something in Tonio's play. Was a lot of just like, I didn't, honestly didn't even notice how he was able to, to get so many grabs. No. There were even situations where he went for a grab and it missed because he slightly misfaced it. Yeah. But it would have worked. It would have worked. Yeah. He was able to grab off those grabs. And Tonio early.